In today's society, autism is often misunderstood and misrepresented. When we refer to autism, we refer to it being as an autistic spectrum. What that actually means is there are so many different parts to that. There are so many different support needs. And one person said to me once, and this will always stay with me, if you've met one person with autism, you've met one person with autism. Every individual is unique, gifted and talented with something wonderful to share and give to the world. Food diversity helped me because they understand autism from, from, from a, a professional and a public medical point of view. Because everybody's got a voice, but in different ways of using it. A lot of autistic people are intelligent, so we're not second class systems, we are who we are. It's just because I've got autism, it's not because I can't excel. I have been uh, honoured a doctorate at South University for my work. People shouldn't, shouldn't assume that it's a learning disability when autism isn't, it's separate. Before I worked here with London, I'd never worked with anyone with autism before, so I had no experience. Some people think that people with autism don't have much to offer or you know, contribute, but Linda's ability to retain like all sorts of knowledge, whether it be music or actors or notable events from like a childhood, it's just the detail that she goes into, it's pretty, it's pretty phenomenal. I've been working with Rose for a long time now. Over them years I've seen Rose really come into herself, uh, do things for herself and make her own choices. Before I started with this company, I had no idea what autism was, the different levels of autism, how to support somebody with autism. But through training and ongoing training, I've learned a lot, which I've been able to put into practice with Rose, which has seen her bloom. At Future Directions, we are committed and passionate about ensuring that our staff receive the training and support they need to effectively provide support to individuals with autism. We specifically run a variety of different levels of autism training. When you understand it and when you get it, it makes providing that support much more effective, enjoyable and you connect with somebody. And that's what this is all about, connecting with individuals for where they are at. As an organisation, that level of commitment has also spanned out to our investment within our PBS lead and also within our autism lead for the organisation. There's a real commitment to being the best at what we do. The training that I've received from Future Directions has been uh, excellent. Um, it's been tailored to the individual that I've been supporting uh, rather than just about autism in general, so it's been really useful uh, in that sense. So I realised having supported people with autism that they don't want to be treated differently just because they have autism mm -hmm. and in particular the person that I support doesn't like the word autism because he feels that it restricts him and it, and it puts him in a box whereas he's got so many other skills that are outside autism. You have to look at the individual rather than the condition. What I'd say to someone if they put a negative slant towards autism is just go talk to them, go speak to them. They have so much to offer, they're just, they're just people. If people didn't understand my autism, to understand me, that's how you understand autism. Being with me, being with my interests, my hobbies, being a part of my life. I don't think anybody should treat anybody different because they've got autism or any condition really. Everyone should be treated as an individual person. Everyone's got their own different characters, personalities and everything like that should be taken into consideration with everybody. Don't treat me any different. Uh, the values of Future Directions are all about putting the person first rather than the disability. And I found that they're very person-centred. So instead of focusing on paperwork and things like that, it's more to do with the care and the, the individual's needs. So I found that to be um, really, really good to work under. I already go to Sofia University and hate crime and other issues around interviewing students, teaching students on how, how to support people with autism. Later on this year, we'll be doing my own autism training with, uh, with Future Directions and eventually help lead in it. If you speak to a number of people who have autism, they will give you very different responses because that's a bit to remember. Everybody is individual, everyone's unique and everyone's communication style is. But that's no different to the rest of the population. Mm -hmm.